Hello everybody, we are Lechu and Cian Solutions Architect from the Wall Architect team and today we will introduce you into a new feature of the Wall Architect tool that will help you to scale and increase efficiency of your Wall Architect reviews. Review templates is the latest feature in the Wall Architect tool. It will help you streamline the review process by enabling you to scale common answers to best practices across multiple workloads. We will be walking through review templates, but first let's start off with a high level overview and context into why we build this feature. Then we will show you how to use the review templates within the Well Architect tool in the AWS console. Many customers consume and build their cloud capabilities from central teams like Cloud Center of Excellence or are building on top of foundational platforms. This means that many times there are set of best practices within the web architecture reviews that are already being applied because teams are already sharing common platforms or processes. Having to go through the best practices and manually select common answers at the beginning of each review can be tedious and inefficient. Historically, customers had to manually fill in common answers, which can cause inconsistencies in how teams are interpreting these best practices, which then results in miscommunication and misalignment. Now, with review templates, you can efficiently pre-fill answers to common best practices to start your reviews with a pre-populated baseline helping your teams save time and focus on more specific and relevant questions per individual workloads. The Well Architect tool provides a mechanism to review the state of your applications and workloads against best practices, which helps you identify areas of strength and areas of improvement in your business. Until now, you have to manually select the common answer for questions that apply to multiple workloads, which has proven to be inefficient. With review templates, the newest feature of the AWS Well Architect tool, you and your teams can start your Well Architect reviews with a baseline review template along allowing you to make your reviews more efficient. Review templates help customers scale common answers to best practices across their workloads. Overall, this helps to reduce redundancy and increase efficiency by streamlining the review processes. Additionally, review templates drive consistency and standardization of best practices across teams and workloads because it can be shared among teams, which helps to ensure alignment and consistent implementation of best practices. And now, let's jump to the demo section. Hey, welcome to the demo section. Are you ready to start using the new review template feature? To do that, you will have to go to the Wall Architect tool. Let's go there. Let's start from the AWS console home using the search bar. In order to go to the Wall Architect tool, you will type Wall Architect and opening it in a new tab. Now, as you can see on my screen, there is a new section on the left pane, which is review template. Let's click there. And from here, you will be able to start creating new review templates by clicking on this orange create template button located at the top right. So let's click there to create a new review template. In the new review template, you must first specify the titles of your template with a title to identify the template, a description, and optional fields like notes and tags. When creating a new template, you can specify the titles with the template name, description, and optional fields like notes and tags. The template owner needs to fill in these details, which will be applied to the workloads generated from these templates. These details are essential to provide necessary context to workload owners who will be later employ this new template in their workloads. In the next step, Apply Lenses, you can see that the Well Architected Framework is included by default, but you can also include Well Architected Lenses and Custom Lenses. For example, if you were focused on serverless application, you may choose to apply an additional lens here by selecting the serverless lens like this. And now, that you created your template, the next step is to start answering questions like any other well-architected framework review. 
So let's start answering a few questions by selecting well-architected framework and then click on answer questions. Okay, let's start answer a few questions in this template by checking the box of the best practices that are already implemented. Please note that you also have the option to mark questions and best practices as not applicable. Also, something to note is that any answer or note that you add will be pre-populated for any workload you create for this template. If you don't want to something to be pre-filled in the created workloads, you can leave it and answer it. One thing to mention is that you can use the notes section with each template question. This will help workload owners to clarify why the given best practices is in place or not, ultimately providing more context during the individual workload review. This will allow your teams and workload owners to start their well architected review with a baseline review template and focus on reviewing their specific applications with reduced redundancy. This drive consistency consistency and standardization of best practices across your teams and their workloads, ultimately helping your teams to adopt well-architected. Once you create a review template, you have the option to either define a workload from it or share it. Now it's time to create a workload review from this template. In the workload section of the tool, you can define a workload from a review template. Please note that review templates can only be applied to new workloads, which is what we are doing here by clicking on the Find from Review Template. So remember, you cannot apply review template to an existing workload. Once you select the Find from Review Template, you can select one of the review templates that you either own or have access through the template share. Then you can define your workload metadata. After selecting a review template to apply, you can choose to add a profile. If you do choose to add a profile, the questions will be prioritized per the profile, but your answers from the template will remain. You can also optionally choose to apply additional lenses. You can now answer your review as you normally would using your review template as a baseline. You may need to make changes to your review template from time to time. So before showing you how to make those changes, let me tell you that the review template owner is the only one allowed to make those changes. Another thing to mention is that any change that you make to your review template will not be affecting to any existing workload defined from that review template. So let me show you how to make some modifications to your review template. Go into the review template section in the left pane. Let's choose your review template. And in the actions menu, let's choose edit. Here we can make modifications to the name and the description, but to update the answers of your review template, you have to click in your review templates, then you have to select the lens that you want to update and finally click on answer questions. After you update the questions of your lens, you click on save and exit and once you back to your review template, Another thing you can do is within the review template menu, you can choose your review template and in the actions menu, you can delete it, which will ask you for the review template name to confirm the deletion. Please note that after that you delete your template, you will no longer be able to define workloads review using that review template. However, any workload review that you created from that review template will not be affected. Now, let me show you how to share review templates. Share review templates among teams promotes scalability and alignment in architectural reviews and ensures consistent implementation of best practices. When you open your new review template, your screen will show the overview of your template by default. So, let's click in the share tabs next to the overview and let's create a template share with another YAM user or other AWS account principles. Invitees to the share will then be able to accept or reject the invitation under the share invitation section of the AWS Well Architected Tool console in their respective accounts.
And not to mention that if you are part of an AWS organization, you can share this review template with it. Using the same menu, you will be able to select the entire organization or an organization unit individually. And with this, we completed the demo section for today. And that's it for today's presentation in this new review templates feature in the AWS Well Architecture tool. Let's do a quick recap. With the new Well Architecture tool review templates feature, you can scale your workload reviews and work more efficiently. This feature eliminates the need to repeatedly answer the same questions for your common workloads, making the review process smoother and allowing you to optimize your resources more efficiently. The sharing feature also promotes consistency and standardization of best practices across workloads and multiple teams, enhancing scalability and alignment in your reviews. And that's it for today. Start creating your own review templates and share it with your team. Thank you.